Hi, this is Nandi with Nandi's Naturals coming to you on day 16 of my testing the no bacon soda deodorant prototype. Things are going heavenly. It's been like bowling and hitting a strike every day. And for anybody who likes to bowl, you know what I mean. You know, when you hit that strike, it's like, yes. And that is how I have been feeling about this deodorant. Volunteers, I haven't had any reported fails from them. I myself have not had any uh, fails. So I would say that we are doing good. And like I told you, in the same realm, I have been tweaking my original pit sticks that do contain baking soda. And I have brought that percentage down. And I mean down considerably because I want to make sure that the ingredients are all in balance, that one is not exceeding the other. And it's so easy because baking soda is such a strong uh, product that it but it doesn't take much for it to exceed the balance you know I'm trying to put this as simply as I can so it doesn't it doesn't take much so you've got to be really careful so that you can avoid as much irritation as possible you know when you know when you're, you're selling stuff like that to the public you mean I mean you don't want 85 percent of the people who buy your deodorant to never buy it again because it's too you know it causes too much irritation so that is uh, that is what I've done as far as the baking soda concentration now I've also decided to remove the arrowroot and I did that because while arrowroot is really absorbent, you remember when I talked to you about sometimes you have to go off recipe, you have to do something different than what everybody else is doing? Well, that's what I decided to do. I decided to do something different. And in different, I decided to remove the arrowroot. Because when you look at it, as good as, arrow, as, good as an absorber as arrowroot has been, it's a starch. And starches turn to sugar from, you know, from what I've studied and researched. And the last thing you need under your arms is a sugar <laughs> is the way I'm looking at it especially if you're someone who's predisposed to you know a, build, a colonization of yeast or something the last thing you need is to have that extra under the arm where there's no sunlight it's a very dark area it's usually damp you know well not all the time but there are times when it's damp and it stays damp a while until it dries or you get cleaned up or cooled off or, or whatever is going to happen to change that environment so I wanted something that does not turn into sugar therefore it does not feed or have the possibility of feeding yeast and so what I did was I upped my clay content and I removed the arrowroot. And I think you're gonna really, really like this new formula with the baking soda because it's very balanced. The balance in it is, I mean, it is, it's very, very good. I can't wait until I can start using that one again, but I've got people who are actively testing this one. And so far, it's been a green flag for that one. And like I said, my no baking soda one has been overshadowing the other because I'm so excited to actually have one that is working that does not require baking soda. So you can see that I've got all kinds of things going on. I'm pretty happy about where all this is going. I'm so happy that you guys have tuned in and are following me on this journey. I'm so thankful to the volunteers for jumping in and putting their arms up, <laughs> you know, and saying, I'll do this for you. I mean, it takes brave souls to, you know, to risk going around other people when the deodorant they're testing does not work or something like that. So I'm grateful to them. Again, you can find us on Facebook at 90s Naturals, you, on Twitter at Creole Girl, K R E Y O L G I R L. Uh, you can also find us on uh, my website, www.90snaturals.com. That will take you to the Facebook page, it'll also take you to uh, Google Plus, uh, our Google Plus page on 90s Naturals. I mean, we're in all kind of places. And oh, did I? I forgot YouTube. How did I forget YouTube? YouTube. You can catch us on our YouTube channel at Nandiya, N A N D I Y A A. See, my mind is gone, and that's because it's close to evening. I'm trying to get this update done so you'll know what we've been up to, and also watching the clock so that I don't make a seven or eight minute video as I sometimes am guilty of doing. That is all I have for today. Thank you for being here. I really, really appreciate you. Now I'm gonna go in and get away from these mosquitoes because they're threatening to tear me up and bumps just don't look good on my skin. They, they really don't. <laughs>